This is a quick review of LM2596 DC to DC buck converter. Um, the range of this board is um, 3 volts to 40 volts input, 1.5 volts to 35 volts output. The board is based on LM2596S uh, Texas Instruments uh, chip. Uh, the uh, documentation uh, PDF available on the Texas Instruments website. Pretty comprehensive PDF with all the characteristics and uh, even example connections uh, diagrams. And um, this this board looks like it's been it's been made uh, as one of the examples because uh, it's quite popular and very very cheap. And it's about one, uh, less than one pound you can buy. Um, but w w what I'm particularly interested in this uh, is the fifth spin of, of the LM chip. Um, at the moment, uh, the, the fifth spin here is wired to the ground. So this, this, this is ground and it's soldered to the ground. Uh, if you look at the uh, docs for the uh, what it says about fifth spin, um, allows switching the switching regulator circuit to be shut down using logic signals. And it says here if, as well if, if this shutdown feature is not required, the on off pin can be wired to the ground pin or can be left open. Uh, Manufacturer of this board decided to to solder it down to uh, uh, ground, but it's not required. And uh, I'll show you later how how you can use this feature, uh, uh, how to how to use this pin, uh, which is um, uh, quite interesting. Um, so if if you have a look um, um, at the operation, current operation, because it should be on as soon as you, as soon as you uh, power it up, it should go on, and that's what happens. Uh, so as soon as you give it input, it, it produces output. Um, I, I wanted to um, uh, create a delayed start because I don't want um, this board go on as soon as as, as I've got input, because input can, could could it's also the other devices connected to to, to that uh, voltage and they uh, can create a ripple and I don't want this I, I, I want clean output to protect my uh, uh, amplifier board after that uh, so what I did is I, um, I cut with, with sharp object I, cu I cut this ground over here and so this way the uh, uh, fifth pin uh, became unconnected and uh, uh, later on I uh, connected this pin to suggested um, for, for delayed uh, start suggested diagram so uh, this is the fifth pin uh, Texas Instruments suggest to connect 47k to the ground and 47k to 0.1 microfarads capacitor. I did exactly that. Um, 0.1 microfarads uh, is very quick. I mean, uh, it's very small capacitor, and you can't even see the delay. There might be delay, but so I had to put a bigger capacitor in here because I wanted about a second delay, maybe. Um, I put three microfarads in here. Then what? What this do? It creates problem. Uh, it works fine when you press it, uh, when you connect it uh, for the first time. But if you quickly switch off and switch on the power, it, 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 it kind of it does not wait another second. It just kind of goes on and then off and then on again. So it, 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 it's, it's really undesired effect because it, it, create, it creates another spike. And I didn't really want this. And what I found out is uh, if I remove this completely, remove this completely, 
and instead of 0 0.1 microfarads, I used 0 0.068. So it's really, really a uh, 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 tiny capaci capacitor, but actually fast uh, at, uh, to um, it, 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 for some reason it discharges, it discharges really fast, but it creates the necessary delay. So what I did, this is what I did. I don't know if you can see. So the, it's cut over here, the capacitor is soldered to this fifth leg and then we got 47 kilo ohms going to the capacitor this is this is what happened if you connect power it creates about a second delay a bit less which is which is quite uh, the higher the voltage actually the longer the delay and I, I, I'm going to operate uh, with about 30 volts so that's fine for me and yeah the, exactly the effect I'm looking for so um, yeah I mean if you need this kind of soft start or delayed start um, this is one of the way to go um, yeah, this is it, and um, pretty nice board. And um, I, now I've got a bunch of them. I, I'm definitely going to use them elsewhere.